Welcome to Patriot League All Access, where we're talking to our football head coaches in the midseason. Today we talk with Bucknell head coach Joe Susan. Coach Susan, how are you doing today? I'm doing well. You know, it's, uh, you get into a pattern of preparing for a game plan, and uh, Monday is when we get uh, our first and second down game plan going. So uh, it's a good break from uh, football, but uh, right after we're finished, I'll get back to football. Well, you've, you've had a pretty good football season so far. You're going 4-1 and one and got a key first win in the Patriot League in your opener against Georgetown on Saturday. Kind of just assess your team's play to this point. Well, we, uh, from a defensive standpoint, I think we've improved every game. You know, we uh, are fortunate that we're healthy and uh, our kids are playing well offensively. Uh, we do have some young guys on our offense. You know, and I think that our quarterback... Brandon Wesley has continued to develop. Uh, he's only a sophomore, and I think every time he's on, it gets better and better. So it's tied into the, you know, number one, staying healthy, but also uh, how those kids play together. And uh, you know, we've been fortunate to play right. You know, we we did lose against Cornell, but uh, that's in the past. We're looking forward to this week against Lehigh. No, your defense has been very good in a number of statistical categories, particularly rush defense and turnover margin. What are some of your reasons for your success on that side of the ball? We're fortunate in that we have what I consider some of the better defensive linemen in this league, and uh, Josh Eaton and Robert De La Rosa. And turnover margins related to something that we're, we really believe here, that uh, you create turnovers and then work to minimize turnovers by practicing and, and every day every time we're on the field we practice ball disruption or ball security and I think that's had a impact on our team that uh, hopefully continues through the rest of the year. Now you mentioned Robert De La Rosa and Josh Eden what have they meant in your two years what have they meant for the Bucknell program in, in kind of being mainstays on your defensive line? Well uh, they are two of the better athletes that we have on on the entire team and what that does is it uh, makes them someone who can hang in there against the run game but also very effective against uh, pass rush by being athletic they also both lead by example and uh, with as many young players as we have they've done a great job of taking the team under their wings regardless of what side of the ball they're on uh, and Showing, showing our younger players that this is the way you do things and this is where you get the most out of it. And they've been outstanding leaders. Now you mentioned some of the younger players. And last year, Brandon Wesley and Victor Walker really played as freshmen. Tyler Smith played as a sophomore. And you have mostly sophomores and juniors at the skill positions on offense. How have those guys been able to develop um, from last year to this year? I think when you make a change in a program, the, the impact of that change takes longer on offense than it does on defense and that the young men have to get used to what you're asking them to do and I think that the combination of what they did last year, uh, what they did this spring and into preseason has really taken effect and again we've been fortunate to stay healthy. They uh, are used to working together and I think they do a great job of complementing one another. Now you play number 10 Lehigh this weekend. They've had one of the top offenses in the country, and you guys have obviously been very good on defense. What do you have to do to, to match up with them, a team that's you know preseason favorite and playing so well right now? Well, obviously, the, the best way to match up against their offense is to keep them on the sideline, and uh, we'll do our best to control the ball when we have it. But uh, I think we, we have to do a job of uh, being efficient in, in terms of controlling the run game, but also being able to vary what we're doing in terms of coverage. They are an outstanding football team. We're going to work to try to keep their receivers in front of us. I think that will minimize some of the, the longer passes that they've thrown. But uh, they are a very good football team, and we're preparing uh, to do a lot of different things against them that uh, we, we feel will be very effective with.